Hello everyone, I'm Ronnie the Raccoon from the Channel Info Roar. Have you ever been asked as a kid what your favorite animal is? I know I have. Even though I always said raccoon, I bet most of you had a different answer. It always went something like this. Hey son, what's your favorite animal? Um, well, I kind of think that the Black Panther is pretty cool, I guess. Or if you're a nerd, you said some other animal. But let's be real here. Everyone wants to pick the Black Panther. It's just so cool looking with all its edgy blackness. Now what if I tell you that all your life you've been living a lie? That the badass Black Panther is not even real. Would you believe me? I don't care if you would, because these are facts. Let me break it down for you. So the Black Panther is not actually a specific species of animal. It is, in fact, two at the same time. How is that possible, you ask? Listen up. There's this thing called melanism. That's when an animal has an increased amount of the dark pigment melanin in their skin, hair, feathers, and so on, giving them a dark appearance. Check out this picture. Now you see many animals here that are usually not this dark, right? Well, that's what melanism does to you, and alcohol. Don't drink, kids. Back to the panther. So what does this all have to do with him? Well, the black panther is actually a presence of melanism in either a leopard or a jaguar. For jaguars, it's a more common occurrence, since 10% of all jaguars born are born with this increased dark pigment. For leopards, it's a true, rare occasion, and only 6 to 8% of them are born with this unique color. So next time someone says their favorite animal is a black panther, you can confidently say, Well, a raccoon explained to me that you are wrong. So you are wrong. I'm better. Screw you. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to InfoRoar for more mind-blowing revelations about the animal kingdom. See you next time.